Hi, and welcome to Wine Around Oz. I'm Kat. And I'm Tim. How are you doing? We are in the wonderful Launceston studio today. Or Lonnie, as it's known to the locals. And we have decided to do something different. We are doing all the wine tastings tomorrow in this area. So being in the Apple Isle, we decided we'd try something different and we'd go for apple cider. Firstly, for me, I have to say, I don't like cider at all. I have never had a cider that I've enjoyed, so I know nothing about cider. So, what it really comes down to is, oops, I'll try and stay in frame there, is, uh, is the cider any good? So, what we've done first is we've brought in a ring in, an outsider, called Threx from South Australia. So, we're going to give that a shot first and use that as a benchmark because it's South Australian. So, here you go. Mm -mm -mm. Glug, 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 glug. That reminds me very much of the Strongbow cider. Um, it doesn't really have a lot of <laughs> a lot of uh, sort of apple uh, residual sort of flavour. It's just sort of just a bang it straight in your throat. Uh, nothing special there, I would Pass. say, about Three Oaks South Australian cider. Now what we've got here is Dickens cider. I don't know if you can see that. Now the thing about Dickens is uh, there's a lot of residual crap in there. Does that mean you should roll it first? Yeah, I probably should have, but I've already opened it. So, um, what are you going to do, huh? Big long um, spoon, stir it. Yeah, yeah, I've got a long spoon. Okay, I'll tell you what. Why don't you sit here and do that? Yeah. So we're going to pass the dick inside for the moment. You can see this is a very organised kind of uh, review this time around. We've got our stuff together well and truly in advance uh, and mercury cider is the other one we came across now you mm -hmm. don't tend to find dickens or mercury outside of so tasmania so mercury is the tasmanian one as well yes yeah, so these are the two tassies and you don't tend to find them outside of tasmania so here we go with the mercury draft cider mm. can't wait to taste this one mm. oh that's worse <laughs> It's actually, it's actually better. Yuck, yuck, yuck. <laughs> uh, uh, I think the Dickens is ready to try as well. <laughs> okay. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> oh. Dickens side is probably oh. the best of the lot, it seems like. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, <laughs> 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 it's so green apple. It's like, what did they do? Pick something God, that was disgusting. just... Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yep, okay, so um, I don't like cider. Oh. I don't like cider, but that was definitely the worst. Don't go there! <laughs> <laughs> this is disgusting. Um, I'm going to go for some more. <laughs> yeah, are you going back again? Ooh. I'm going to try this one again. Um, let's see. Mm. Mm. Yeah, oh, okay, God. so the mercury. Um, yeah, after tasting <coughs> the Dickens, <laughs> it's quite drinkable. Um, I'm going to try this one again, yep. the South Australian. The Three Oaks. The Three Oaks is most like uh, Strongbow, as I said before. Mm. It's a, a Strongbow draft, so if you're into a Strongbow. No. But I find Strongbow tends to be fairly just bland, lame. I like the Bulmers, I like the Magnus. Personally, I like the Magnus the most. So if you like your Magnus, uh, you're most likely going to uh, like the uh, Mercury here. Mm -hmm. That's if you can get them. Most of the time, these they aren't available outside, outside Tasmania. Tassie, yeah. So if you're in Tassie and you see them, Give them a go. Give this one a go. Um, if you're in South Australia, well, you know, whichever's cheaper out of this and Strongbow. And uh, if you really feel like being sick, just try some Dickens. Yeah. All right. No well, good. There you go. Something different from Enjoy wine around us. I'm going to go back to my Riesling. Yeah. Yeah. All right. We'll tell you what we think of the Tamar Valley wines a little later. Mm. All right. Bye-bye. <coughs> Say goodbye, Kat. Bye-bye.